Hi guys, it's me, it's Michelle from Sweets and Soaps. I'm feeling a lot better today. And to be doing the review. <clears throat> and actually, um, you'll probably hear a lot of <clears throat> some sneeze, some coughing. I still have some congestion, but it's a lot better. So anyways, um, I'm on here simply for the fact to do a follow-up to some of the soaps that I have purchased from some lovely soap makers out there. Um, I just want to thank them again for um, sending me some of their products and their samples and um, some items I've used and some I don't. Um, so I pretty much passed on some of the items. Um, and the first one that I ever I've ordered, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> is from K. Cherie Soaps. Um, her soaps are lovely. They smell great. Um, we used um, her. We used a couple of them. And I, I mean, I wish I could show you which ones we used, but of course we used them all, so they're not there anymore. <laughs> um, um, we did use her Twilight Wood. Um, she had another one in there that was um, that looked like a teddy bear. I don't know what fragrance that was, but I loved the scent. Um, that one I did find a little drying for my skin and my daughter, so we use that as a hand soap. Um, the um, hold on, <coughs> excuse me. Um, the Twilight Wood, which was a cupcake, worked great. I had no problems with it. Didn't need to put lotion on when I got out the shower. So that's how I judge my soaps. So if I'm using a soap that I've purchased from you and I have to use so I mean, lotion after I get out the shower, um, then that's telling me it's a little too drying for my skin. Um, and you know, I have, I think I have tough skin, but I do dry out. So <laughs> hence, I have lotions. I don't like to use lotions. Um, I prefer just hopping off the shower, but sometimes I have to lotion up. Even with my own soap, I sometimes, depending on the fragrance or if I've changed the recipe or whatever, I'll have to use lotion. But most of the soaps that I use, which are mine, um, I don't have to use lotion. I just get out the shower, dry off, and go get dressed and, you know, deodorize and whatever else. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, we've also used, and I just cannot... She has one in there called Blue Sugar. I, I just can't use it. It smells so good. I do not want it to go anywhere. <laughs> so, that one we see how. But her soap so far, other than that, aside from the ones that have a hint of cinnamon, I think there's another one that's a cupcake that has a hint of cinnamon that um, I'm finding cinnamon is a little drying to my skin. It kind of irritates it. So, and <clears throat> I use soap all over, so you can best believe where it's irritating. So, leave that to the imagination or you guys want to mean so anyway so Kay has some very good soaps I love her fragrance they're not extremely strong um, but they work fine for me again I when I'm in a shower I don't like to be overwhelmed with fragrance um, some of mine I even find too strong some not all because mine aren't really really strong strong but they're fine but I, I really like her so you guys check out Kay she has some very cute soaps, and I know she's been busy doing some charitable work, um, I believe for her church or for her community. I think it's from her community. So she may or may not have anything listed. I don't know. I haven't been there in a while. So um, she has an Etsy shop, and I'll have it um, in the down bar um, of her um, shop. So you guys check her out. She has some great soaps. She's also on YouTube. She has a link to, I can put another link down there to YouTube for her YouTube station and she shows you making some of her wonderful creations she's very creative she was a she used to decorate um, cakes so <coughs> she's just started decorating um, soaps the same way so she has some very cute stuff too now the next soap I ordered um, I got now most of these soaps I purchased they'll purchase my own money they just put samples in for me to send <coughs> sorry um was from the hen and her chicks and her name is Lori and Lori has some very nice soaps right now I've been using her whip soap in um as a hand soap at, um it was a little drying for my skin for the shower so it's hand soap too so right now that's the one that's on the plate and I just used it and I like the way it smells I like and it really doesn't dry my hands because I don't follow up with lotion all the time. I ain't got time for all that. Um, even though I make lotion or whip shea butters and I have lotions laying around the house. 
I ain't got time to sit there and pop some lotion on my hand because by the time I get to the next thing, I'm getting to some more water and guess what? The lotion's washed off. So there's no need. So I, again, I judge my soaps based on do I need lotion is how well they work for me. Um, I haven't used, let me see which one, I used that one. And I use another one of hers and I have no adverse effect. So Lori has some really nice soaps. She has also has a YouTube channel um, showing her some of her lovely creations that she makes. And she is a bow queen, she, or she's a foo-foo queen. She loves girly, girly stuff. And she loves to make it look so pretty. And she does. So when I got my package, it was, it was wrapped very nicely um, with a nice big yellow bow. And the yellow bow that she put on there is now on my um, grandbaby bear <laughs> and I don't have any grandbaby but this is my grandbaby bear my baby um, she loves her um, teddy bears from um, build a bear so we have it on her very special okay on one of her very special bears she got for Christmas and it's a yellow bear it's a topaz bear so that one where's the bow and thank you because it looks very pretty on her so anyways um, I love her stuff um, I believe she's the one who sent me, I want to say that was hers, that shea butter in a little heart, yes, I believe, I think, I swear, I think that's the only one, because I love, it was a tea tree and mint, oh my god, I, okay, at first I did not like tea tree, I mean, the, the smell of tea tree or uh, melaleuca, some of you guys know it by melaleuca, irritated me, because it was so strong, it's like, ugh, but I had been using when I first started school um, when I used the restroom there the soap was drying so I had to have some time plus we use we wash our hands all the time at school so my hands were drying out so I started taking her little container of whipped shea butter which was in it with um, tea tree and mint and I fell in love with it I love that smell I, I don't know that melaleuca and mint or tea tree and mint smells so freaking good it's like it reminds me of like wet dirt okay this again I love the smell of wet dirt Ooh, and the smell of chalk dust yes okay so that is what it reminds me of, and I love to put it on I love how it feels even though and I'm all in class mm -hmm, sniffing on my hand and stuff but I'm out mm -hmm, and I don't have any more tea tree oil I am out of that too here so I'm gonna have to see what I can do so anyways that smells good and she has some very cute products too so you guys need to check her out also the hen and her chicks you guys need to watch out watch for these girls when they have sales they have very good pricing the price of the soap you know I mean may be less than what the shipping is but once they put the shipping in I think they're like me when I um, send my when you order soap for me um, usually the shipping is going to be more than you know the shipping cost so I refund you back whatever it is if it's more than a dollar because I'm not going to send 25 cent back because I just bank y'all for that one even thought about that or 75 but if it's over a dollar I refund whatever it is uh, back to you and when you receive the package you'll see how much you paid for it and then you can do compare notes and if I messed up I'm sorry <sighs> just let me know okay so I'm thinking they do the same thing like that for me I, as I do so I don't know but anyways you guys you guys need to check them out all these girls or all these ladies have wonderful soaps they all each have their own quality about you know how they make them so that is the hen and her chicks you should check her out she has some very very cute stuff too so and then the next one I ordered was sensational soaps and it was Sarah who, um, and I haven't used my free sample yet, <laughs> but it smells so good. Um, Sarah with Sensational Soaps, um, she is so sweet. Um, she has a son who is special needs, and they have this wonderful um, chair, um, donation, well, a soap that they make. It's either in blueberry, oh my god, I can't remember the other one, but I ordered the blueberry and they ain't got no more I think I've used it all up I it is a glycerin soap and you guys know I really don't use glycerin soap but it felt very good on the skin 
and when I ran out, I was like, oh, you got more. And since I don't really use glycerin soap or make it, when I want some, I will be ordering from her. Um, every bar soap that she sells um, of, um, hold on, <coughs> excuse me. Um, every, okay, let me just go back over and say that, um, her soaps are wonderful, and she really, 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 um, knows her honey soaps, and, um, oh yeah, I was talking about special needs, <laughs> I'm like, oh, I'm all over the place, I'm so sorry, um, uh, but, um, it's her belief soap, and, um, and for every so bar they sell they send a dollar um to the special um to her foundation or foundation who um represents or works with special needs kids but anyways um for yeah so you guys should check her out um and see what she has she's the one who sells the propolis soaps um the, the honey soaps the um um royal jelly soaps she has a wide and vast knowledge of using these items that the bees give. These are the miracle of the bees. Love bees, bees, bees. You need them. Um, but her products are wonderful. They smell great. She, when I ordered her free sample, was a bar of her um, honey strawberry soap. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. And that one, I couldn't get enough of when I was taking a shower. It was so nice on the skin. It did not dry me out it had wonderful fragrance and I have nothing but good words to say about her soaps too um, the only problem that we encountered was I cut the propolis soap up for us three my th for me and my two sisters and um, one of my sister had an adverse effect um, she did break out more that was my youngest sister she has very sensitive skin very sensitive um, it was very drying for her she had to follow up with an an oil-free moisturizer um, but I told her to stop using it because her skin she just kept breaking out so I said I couldn't figure out what was going on so I just said stop using it and so she did and my older sister who had it had no problems with it pretty much I think she said she had a couple of oily spots but I mean excuse me drying spots but she went through with an oil-free or oil moisturizer and moisturized her skin uh, me for my skin Anything I apply to it makes it dry, so I couldn't really tell. It did um, keep the skin clean, um, so no problems with it. So you guys get it, buy it, whatever. Um, good stuff. All her stuff is good. I'm still working on. Um, I think I now have a bar of my soap in there because I had to use some of my soap because um, um, I needed to make sure that the soap I'm sending out is, is still good so I use it for a week and to figure out if it's gonna affect and I use it all over so and you can just met all over okay from top middle bottom all so anyways um, those are the three I've purchased and used I just received my Fox Run soap a couple a day or a couple two days ago and I haven't used any of that so I can't tell you any um, effect on my skin and my daughter's skin about that so but once I do I will update you guys and let you guys know um, I forgot to say I'm going to also put sensational soaps link down here she also has a YouTube I believe she also has a blog I mean I think all these people have blogs and that I ain't got no blog but um, and they can show you them making their soap and using it and everything else so that's another person so all four people Kay Cherie the hen and her chicks sensational soaps and fox run soaps and sundries I have all bought and paid for my own money and they all either smell wonderful and work great so give them a try and you guys next the next time you guys can do an update on how the soap work for you not just me and snow blue <laughs> so anyways you guys have a good one and I will holler and talk to y'all later sorry so long I'm gonna send you guys peace and deuces Love you guys. Have a good one. Bye.